The sun is disgustingly powerful. And it's also humid. And there's creatures here that can kill you. Biggest changes for me since the last series of Joy Destroyers, I've lost two stone. I'm a lot lighter and healthier. I've also moved in with my boyfriend and my boyfriend is moving away this year for two years for work. I've been to Australia before, but not to the Gold Coast. My first impressions were, it's ridiculously fucking hot. It's intense. The sun is disgustingly powerful. And it's also humid. And there's creatures here that can kill you. Ah! So far, some of the boys, they are a lot fitter than Newcastle boys because they all surf. Australia, the great continent where life centers on the miracle strands of beach. Or skateboard, or go to the gym. And they all have muscles and six packs. It's quite nice to watch. A word I've learned that a lot of Australians say is, hey, at the end of a sentence, like, did you have a good night? Yeah, it was good, eh? Or like, I'm thirsty, eh? I've also learned that they put O on the end of words. Like, my name out here has become Natho, and a dog out here is called a doggo. Oh, why? Best things about life down under, it is always summer. And what they consider to be their winter is our summer. So it's actually always nice and warm. But then the downside is it's fucking hot. Now, when I talk about hot, this is hotter than the devil's ass itself. The other day it was like 40 degrees, or what felt like 40 degrees, when actually it was 20 degrees. I was sweating my tits off. Going from what's happened so far in the house, it's very apparent that the Geordies can drink a lot more than the Aussies. I thought Aussies were mad for it, like, love to party. So far, they haven't proved themselves. One of them passed out, and the other one just blacked out. And I'm still waiting for the other one to get pissed. Why I've been in Australia, I've tried Witchity Grub. It's one of them big caterpillar things, and honestly, it wasn't that bad. It tasted like almonds. I wouldn't do it again, though. Best hangover cure while being in Australia is dipping in the pool or getting in the sea because it's so hot. You don't want to lie around tanning. You actually want to be wet. The best animal encounter I've had so far was when we went to this little petting zoo thing and a kangaroo held my hand. It wouldn't let go. I think I fell in love. Well, a psychic told my mum that I was going to move to Australia when I'm older and have a wife and children. But I'm gay and I love cock, so I don't think that's gonna happen. Oh no, oh no.